Remind yourself that God is with you and nothing can defeat him. Positive thinking is how you think about a problem. Enthusiasm is how you feel about a problem. The two together determine what you do about a problem. Fill the day with enthusiasm. Give the day all you've got and it will give you all it's got. Think excitement, talk excitement, act out excitement, and you are bound to become an excited person. If you are not getting as much from life as you want, then examine the state of your enthusiasm. You'll always get an idea if you think. Don't panic. A positive thinker does not refuse to recognize the negative. He refuses to dwell on it. Positive thinking is a form of thought which habitually looks for the best results from the worst conditions. Believe you can. And you can. Belief is one of the most powerful of all problem dissolvers. When you believe that a difficulty can be overcome, you are more than halfway to victory over it already. If you want things to be different, perhaps the answer is to become different yourself. Change your thoughts and you change your world. Believe in yourself. Have faith in your abilities. Without a humble but reasonable confidence in your own powers, you cannot be successful or happy. People become really quite remarkable when they start thinking that they can do things. When they believe in themselves, they have the first secret of success. The tests of life are not to break you, but to make you. Never let any mistake cause you to stop believing in yourself. Learn from it and go on. The only people who don't have problems are in a cemetery. Live your life and forget your age. When you expect the best, you release a magnetic force in your mind, which by a law of attraction tends to bring the best to you. Expect great things, and great things will come. The person who sends out positive thoughts activates the world around him positively and draws back to himself positive results. Have great hopes and dare to go all out for them. Have great dreams and dare to live them. Have tremendous expectations and believe in them. Put your trust in God and just go calmly on your way. Believe that you are bigger than your difficulties, for you are indeed. How you think about a problem is more important than the problem itself. So always think positively. 
The trouble with most of us is that we would rather be ruined by praise than saved by criticism. Stand up to an obstacle. Just stand up to it, that's all. Don't give way under it, and it will finally break. You will break it. Something has to break, and it won't be you. It will be the obstacle. Ask for what you want, but be willing to take what God gives you. It may be better than what you asked for. Don't let any obstacle stop you. Always remember that you have spiritual and mental qualities within you that can overcome even the seemingly impossible. Expect the best, and with God's help will attain the best. If you put off everything till you're sure of it, you will never get anything done. Fear is never a reason for quitting. It is only an excuse. Yesterday ended last night. Every day is a new beginning. Learn the skill of forgetting and move on. Never react emotionally to criticism. Analyze yourself to determine whether it is justified. If it is, correct yourself. Otherwise, go on about your business. When you are afraid, do the thing you are afraid of, and soon you will lose your fear of it. Joy increases as you give it, and diminishes as you try to keep it for yourself. Every problem contains the seed of its own solution. If you think lack, you tend to create a condition of lack. Shift your thought pattern to one of abundance and believe that God is now in the process of giving you the abundance you need. Learn to relax. Your body is precious, as it houses your mind and spirit. Inner peace begins with a relaxed body. Make a mental list of happy thoughts and pass them through your mind several times every day. Help other people to cope with their problems, and your own will be easier to cope with. One of the greatest of all principles is that men can do what they think they can do. It is indeed possible for those who have the will, courage, and faith. First thing every morning before you arise, say out loud, I believe. 